Yo, 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 welcome back. This is the Kickoff FC show. This is your boy, right? 2012, and that's your boy. Not Roomba. You already know, man, we are here talking about every single thing. Manchester United. And today, we're talking about the beatdown that just took place. The Burnley. Against Barnsley. Squash out. Yeah, yeah, we needed that. Barnsley, yeah. We definitely needed that victory. But you know what else we need? That room boy is going to tell you right now. Yeah, man. Just make sure you see you hit that like button. Hit the subscribe. Let's grow the channel together. You know what I'm saying? Fans of United. Unite. Hit that notification bell so you get notified every time we drop a new video. Matches are coming fast. And furious. Videos are coming even faster. Let's get it. Let's get it, y'all. So you already know, we're jumping right in. We're talking about... The beat down against Barnsley. 7-0. Yes. Thriller. Great victory. A good moral booster is what I would yeah, say. That's more, all, more over, you know? Yeah, I'm not convinced of anything particular. Yeah. I'm not convinced of anything particular because it's Barnsley. You know what I'm say? The last time we played them, it was another bug up 7-0. But like you say, it's a moral booster. You know, some man get some goals under them belt. They need it. Clean sheet for your nana. You see? There was a lot of wins in this. It's not yeah. not even to talk about the 7 0, but nah. outside of the 7 0, there exactly. are a lot of wins in Personal this. Personal wins, individual. Right. Let, let, yeah. Let's start from the top. Ten Hag, you got your road squad rotation right. Yeah. You got your tactics right. Again, it's against Barnsley, but again, you need those type of games against those teams so you can get a moral booster and a confidence booster. You get what I'm right. saying? So, Ten Hag. Great job. You yeah, know, man. good rotation of the squad. Rashford, you went from zero shots, not even zero shots on top, just zero shots. Yeah. To and getting a goal, goal that day before. And then now in this game, you get two goals. Yeah. Nice build up for you. Almost could have had a hat trick too. But yeah, that's a, we take the brace, you know. Anthony, nobody needed a goal or something more than yeah, one goal did. in one year. I'm done much in quarter already for the hey, year. Hey, man. <laughs> he had to take the penalty. He Ain't no to. way nobody else will go take the had penalty. To. It was a brilliant run. Yeah, man. And him get the him win the penalty. Exactly. I'm gonna love the fox of the team. Say, yo, Anthony. Go ahead. Go ahead. You dog. need a chip you off your shoulder. Yeah. I'm glad you didn't do no penenka or no full full <laughs> run up or no. You Just what I'm beat it in the back of the net and yeah, get your yeah. goal, and that's what he did. Exactly. You understand? I'm gonna love it. Because you needed it. Again, another moral booster win. Yes. Garnacho, who has probably been one of the more informed players from Manchester United. Without whether a doubt. start or him come off of the bench. Without a doubt. He's informed. He's one of the more informed players, like I said. Mm. And he got goals as well, too. But here's the surprise of the moment. Huh. Christian Eriksen. Look the like the heart attack. It looked like he's re rewinding the clock on that one because yo Benjamin Button, if you will. Yeah, cause he scored the previous game and he was playing good yeah. coming in for Techie and take over Casimir. As much in that, eh? Who would have thought? Who would have thought? The defensive liability of Ericsson would be the spark that the midfield need. You can't even hear about me in the last two game Ericsson played. Mm -mm. Because Ericsson touches and passes have mm -mm. been mm -mm. on point. You know what I mean? So he ain't giving the ball away unnecessarily in the middle of the pitch. Which puts more pressure on our defense and make we look like so we not even have no sense out there. Yeah, exactly. You see what I say? Then can I get ridiculed because the midfielder gave the ball. Ericsson is a sure, sure forward pass. And here's one thing with that, Zian. If if I'm playing Ericsson, right? Mm. You're not playing you for your defensive purposes. I'm no. playing you for your offensive purposes. So if I'm putting a team and a squad like that out there, my 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 message as a coach is we are attacking. Yeah. We're not trying to play on the counter attack. We're trying no. to attack non-stop. You understand what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. This is not the squad to be a hey, let's play counter attack and defend. No. Same. Putting this squad out there to attack. We're not putting Ericsson out there to make no tackles. No. You get what I'm saying? And that's why I said, yo, I like the performance. It was a moral booster from everybody from the top down. Everybody played good. 
Even when the substitution them come in, they still played well. Yeah, because it's Barnsley. <laughs> Oh my God. That's what I'm saying. I mean, yeah, as a United fan, it's good to feel rejuvenated by this win here. But let's not get ahead of ourselves. You know what nah, I'm saying? Not even. Let's not act like we're not playing like garbage for three weeks. You see, win one game in the league or two now. It's, it's, it's abysmal still. I'm still got questions mm -hmm. of Ten Hag. But I this, definitely like, still have mm. questions for Ten Hag. But like I said... I criticize him when he deserve him criticism. Yeah. But when you deserve credit, I'm going to give you your credit. Yeah, and man. today, Tenag deserves some credit. He and got my it right. prediction was right. <laughs> a 5 nil turns into a 7 nil. <laughs> I'll take the you over take on that. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> you, know, you see, the times my youth have changed. Because you know, normally, Barnes would mm. be an automatic force. But yeah. uh, given the form we were in, Coming in, I'm like, you yo, never I, know. I don't know what to expect. Facts. And I, I, it should be a 5-0 beating. Yeah. And I'm so glad it was a 7 because Barnes did exactly what we needed them to do. Give the team a moral boost. And let's see what happened. How them take that into the next game after that to see what we're going to talk about. That because more videos are going to be coming soon. Mm -hmm. And get what I mean I say? In the meantime, trust and believe this was a really good victory. Top down. Mm -hmm. Enjoy it. Beautiful. Where you go on your prediction? You went, you went, you went, you went big. And I was I mean, like, what the hell? It's Barnsley. I didn't okay. even look at their roster. I don't know how they play, <laughs> but it's Barnsley. You're not in the league. So that means you must get trashed. Yeah, humble yourself. Welcome. You had all, I hope you took some pictures at Old Trafford. <laughs> I hope you, because you're never coming back. Oh, shit. Yeah, <laughs> not this season. <laughs> Back here. <yeah. laughs> Bye, Barnsley. Yeah. Appreciate you, though, okay? JJ's in the shot. You already know. Anyway, man, this is your boy, right? 2012, that's your boy. Don Roomba. Let us know what your thoughts are down here in the comments, man. In the meantime, thanks for watching, man. We out.